Hi everyone, it's Casey again. I am so excited to read this next book for Storytime with the Young Gardeners program. My baby girl is here and she wants to read this book with us too. This is a book that I bought a long time ago and I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, and I hope you love it too. It's called Vegetable Glue, written by Susan Chandler and illustrated by Elena Odriozola. Ooh, Young Gardeners Program kids can help me identify some of these. What's that? A radish. This one looks kind of like a carrot, but usually carrots that we cultivate aren't white. It's a turnip. What's this guy? A leek. And then this guy. Oh, this beautiful lady. Lettuce, snap peas, and I think cucumbers. You wanted to see? Let's get started. Now I'm going to use an accent for this book. So if you don't like it, just don't watch this video. When my right arm fell off, I knew what to do. I stuck it back on with vegetable glue. Where's her arm? Ah! It flew off when she threw the ball for her dog. When my head rolled away, I thought it had gone. But I found it again, and I stuck it back on. She did. Why is her head falling off? You can see for yourself that something's just not right. People don't fall apart. It's just not polite. I have to keep with me a big tub of glue to stick bits back on and to make sure it's new. I hear you all shout, we've heard quite enough. Tell us how do we make that goopy green stuff? If our noses fall off, then what would we do? Where would we buy some vegetable glue? Look at this fun page, there's so many noses. Like, that's not a nose at all, that's a beak. And that's a pig nose. I think that's a little mouse nose. Well, it's not in the shops and it's not on the telly because vegetable glue is in everyone's belly. That's where it's supposed to be. When you eat up your greens, your body makes glue, which keeps all of your bits sticking to you. But I was quite silly. I made a mistake. I wouldn't eat good things. I only ate cake. That does look like a good cake. Look. Mm. I wouldn't eat cabbage or turnips or beans. I didn't like carrots and I didn't like greens. I didn't eat sprouts and now I've no special glue. No goodness inside me like other kids do. While others are playing, I can't even cough. If I sneeze or I burp, then something falls off. What flew off? Her ear! Do you see it? It flew off! Oops! Pardon me. I've made a rude sound. My bottom dropped off and is now on the ground. Do you see that? Her little tushy's on the floor. Oh no. Now here is my granny to give me some more. She's looking quite good for 104. She'd like you to know why she's so fit and able. She ate all her greens before leaving the table. There goes granny. She's got a bag full of supplies, two bags. She ate all her greens and I hope you do too. Then you'll never need any vegetable glue.
the end. Vegetable glue. We always eat our vegetables every day at the Young Gardeners program. Thanks for joining me.